Greetings fam, this is Will from Chile Kun Inc. Today we're discussing on how to use a Bakai MPK Mini with a native instrument machine. This is the machine 2.6.8 software and on this particular software I'm not using the, the, the Machina controller. I'm only using the Akai MPK Mini as my controller. This particular video assumes that you've already taken the Akai MPK Mini and I you know established it as one of the controllers in your preferences now I was having problems with the MPK Mini it was not play all of the sounds in a group across the keyboard it would only play one sound so th there's no snare like here there's no hi-hat here like it should be so what we want to do is change some of the settings in Machina so that it reads the, so that it could read the MPK Mini the way that we want it to so one of the first things you want to do is change, change from the sound to group and then you want to go from this little icon, which is the plug-in icon, to the controller icon. Once we get there, we want to change from output to input. And then go to source and go from none to MPK Mini 2. And again, that assumes that you've already made those adjustments here. Now you can go back to plug-in. And when you play, well, we have to go down an octave. As you can see, we're playing the kick drum with this particular C, I think that's right below middle C, C4, I believe it's called, or C2, C2, I think. And you get all 16 sounds. Now there are times when you would rather have just when you would rather have this keyboard to just play one sound. Say, for instance, a saxophone sound or a trumpet sound. Let's finish. Let's just pull the trump uh, sax, the clarinet, the clarinet right where the kick is. Go back to channel and play that as none. horrible clarinet okay let's go back down and let's remove that all right and now we're back to the MPK mini So now you can actually play B, you know, and you can play multiple instruments on a, of a drum kit at the same time, you know. You can also use the same technique when you're playing samples or waves, you know, like if you're, you know, chopping up somebody else's song and you want to chop it up in these individual slices. I'll show that on a, on a future video. Uh, but that's it. That's how you set up the MPK Mini so that it plays more than one instrument instead of just playing one instrument. Or you can set it up so that it only plays one instrument if you're playing trumpet or saxophone or guitar or whatever you want to do. Um, that's it for that. Um, if you like this particular video, please click like, uh, comment. If you have a comment, uh, if you have a question, you know, um, shoot it to me. If I can answer it, I will. Thanks again. This is Will from Chile Kuni and have a great day.